Hi everyone. So today I'm gonna be telling you something that you probably didn't know and you really want to know about this thing. So if you are in uh, your college and you are in uh, doing any kind of degree, and if you're someone who has just recently got graduated, or someone who has a gap year want to switch to IT industry, but you don't have any direction, you don't either have skills. If you have skills but you don't have the proper skills you don't feel ready this video is for you that is why i'm this uh, creating this video you have to watch this video till the end because every detail that you require now will be uncovered here so when i was in my college the biggest dilemma that i had was internships kaha se kare? so everybody in the college was saying do the internship uh, in your third year do the internship when your fourth year start do the internship in the second year also but I was quite blank those days because of the fact that I was a girl and the next thing was where do I go to do, do all such internship college is not sponsoring any and um, how can I go uh, there and do any kind of technical internship and the fact that I was not from a uh, CS background used to hit me because uh, of the fact that I didn't have any technical skill at all so this is something that uh, that is a big bigger problem but right now not many of you know it that government of India is sponsoring a lot of internship. So AICTE is a portal wherein you will get lakhs of internship. Some are paid, some are unpaid. The best thing about those internships is that you can even earn money through it. But even cherry on the top is that there are absolutely stunning technical skills that you will be gaining throughout this journey. So I talk about a lot of skills, a lot of technologies on my channel like SAP, Salesforce, AWS, uh, Python development, Salesforce development, Salesforce architect and there are many okay so which one you want to choose if you want to choose multiple and then came to a conclusion that you can also do there so that is the reason and this is something that you can add in your resume when you are appearing for any kind of interview this is absolutely crazy and the quantity of these internships the, the amount of internships are like uh, I like one lakh plus so this is the best thing that I could hear and I hope this video reaches all the people who really want to know about the internship in their career and these internships are not just for someone who is doing BTEC someone who is doing BCA, BCom, MBA and even the BSc degree that is also uh, relevant here so this is the portal All India Council of Technical Education it is like giving so many opportunities to the ones who really need it yeah, I have talked about it a lot. Let's go into my computer screen and tell you the, the opportunities that are listed and where you can apply, what is the thing. So yeah, let's go to the computer screen and see. So here I'm on the portal and I'm I'm gonna be uh, providing you the link of the portal. If you don't want to go through the portal, I, you can simply search AICT internship and you will be here and it will show that there is no internship found. They they must be having a technical glitch here that they feel they, they need to fix and what should we say about the government websites. But let, let's just click over here and go to the posted internship that were already present okay so this is the python development internship and this is an uh, immediate internship whoever wants to go in the python development part i will tell you python is very very crucial uh, when you are joining the it and if you become a developer it's well and good because of the fact that you will be handling a lot of things and you cannot be replaced so many times and I, I see it on my company as well they have they carry heavy importance in the industry itself so whenever you open it you will uh, just click on I'm not a robot and then you can apply over here I'm not gonna apply because I really think it's not for me that is the reason they, they would be asking you certain details I have seen uh, people applying through it so yes you can go ahead and do that okay and the credit is for obviously every uh, credit matters when you are doing any uh, kind of work in your engineering next is multi-domain internship multi-domain internship is actually paying you and you have to apply by november okay and um, yeah this is also good let's see what kind of domain they are going to teach over here okay so they, they this is relevant for someone who is be b tech or mem tech and this is an unpaid internship and the number of openings are 200 so you can apply this one as well now the the obviously the internships are quite easy earlier it was a headache 
so yes uh, this was a paid internship next le- next we are going to go ahead with this tally uh, infotech solution so these are the companies that are actually going through the internship and uh, the government itself is um, like recognizing those company and uh, providing it on their portal only so there are there are, there are uh, internships that that have a huge number like this and they there are internship that have a 10 uh, openings so it's like the count is even more than 1 lakh so and these are all the internship that you have to apply by 6 november or sometimes it's even early like you have to apply this internship just now python eiml this one is a great uh, combo and yes web development you have to apply by 30 event management intern so it's not just the only technical you you will operation skills are also mattered over here event management intern content analyst okay so there, there are internships that are analyticals as well so it depends what is your uh, what is exactly you want python eiml and then machine learning intern so there are internship in the data science data engineering ai sales process offline job in noida so they are also giving you a job so the stipend is 26000 but it's more like counted in a internship only okay data analysis with python internship okay to of them and these are all active right now at least okay human resource so hr internship so so, so i've told you that these are uh, paid and unpaid data entry interns are also welcome so there are 76 pages even if you don't feel that your skills matches there are so many openings that you can go through and really feel lucky about it let's go from the back zango so th- these are the internships that are going to be uh, coming uh, late so if you have a time you can apply from the back side so skill development and internship program 75th of page a thousand opening for machine learning internship we are lucky to find this one and then msbi and power bi number of opening is 50 you have to explore a lot in this one data analyst 7000 monthly and the fact that this is true because this is this is a government portal obviously you are going to get these these internships and uh, yeah python 7000 uh, and number of openings are 100 so if you go from back whatever i felt that you will be getting stipend as well and the number of openings are m- more when you look from the back and in the front it's like the the openings are uh, filling out and they are updating it so that is the reason uh, the openings are showing less embedded design iot's so whoever is from uh, ec double e uh, eie so these are the 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 uh, trades are relevant for this embedded design and uh, yeah java internship artificial intelligence internship thousand opening is there I wish I could apply one because these are really really interesting internships that I could see okay next uh, yeah so uh, in this short video we cannot go through all the internship but I'm really really sure that it's even more than two lakhs uh, opening and uh, whoever is willing to apply will surely get these internship and the fact that uh, you'll be able to do an internship you will be able to get real time hands-on skill on something is very very important in getting a good uh, package with a good job so yeah this was it for this video if you have any query suggestion or doubt you can write in the comment section below i would highly appreciate your time in writing such comment bye bye for now until we meet next time